This is Rob Hartzer with TSAOG Orthopedics on wound care after shoulder arthroscopy. Shoulder arthroscopy allows us to work through small incisions. These are usually a centimeter or about a half an inch or less. Through those small incisions and the plastic cannulas that you see in the video, we can place the implants that we need to do repair, such as the rotator cuff in this video, tying knots and removing pathologic tissue, removing bone spurs, etc. As you can see in the video, there's a lot of fluid that's pumped into the shoulder through the end of the scope while we're working. Uh, and this uh, takes some time to go down after surgery. The day following surgery, uh, we would like for you to wait 24 hours to do this, but you can um, remove the very sticky tape uh, that is uh, holding down some bulky gauze over the shoulder. Uh, this can be kind of uncomfortable removing that tape because it is uh, quite sticky. That uh, usually will um, bring all of that gauze uh, with uh, some very slight bleeding that can happen uh, through the incisions uh, off with it. There are plastic stary strips um, that are placed over each of the arthroscopy portals and usually there's about three or four of those on the shoulder after surgery. Um, what we're showing here, we uh, do about a week after surgery for uh, during your wound check visit, um, just carefully removing that first set of stary strips. And we would like for you to try to keep these in place uh, until you come back to the office. If they happen to fall off, then they can be replaced uh, with just a regular Band-Aid. 24 hours after surgery, it's okay to shower and just let water uh, run over the stary strips. Um, please try not to submerge those, uh, those incisions, um, such as uh, swimming in a lake uh, or a river, the ocean, or even a bath, um, but showering is okay. Uh, during the wound check visit, again, which is usually around a week or less after surgery, uh, We'll carefully remove that first set of stary strips, uh, gently cleanse each one of those portal incisions, and then replace with another set of stary strip band aids. These will stay in place uh, for another week or two after surgery, and we would like for you to leave that second set uh, in place until they fall off on their own. In this example, this uh, patient. Uh, it's about 24 hours after surgery, so you can see that those wounds are still a little bit fresh and um, there's still some swelling around the shoulder. 